Have you ever heard the phrase air dirty laundry in public? It's a common English idiom that can be confusing for beginner learners. Let me share a funny story that illustrates a common misunderstanding. My friend Jenna once thought it meant literally hanging up her dirty clothes outside for everyone to see. She was so embarrassed when she realized the true meaning. So, what does air dirty laundry in public actually mean? It refers to the act of revealing or discussing personal or private information in a public setting. The idiom originated from the idea of literally airing out your dirty clothes for everyone to see. Let me give you an example of using this idiom correctly. Imagine your coworker is complaining about a personal issue with their spouse during a team meeting. They would be airing their dirty laundry in public by discussing their private marital problems in front of their colleagues. Now, let's look at some diverse examples of how to use air dirty laundry in public in different contexts. Casual conversation, I don't want to air my dirty laundry, but my neighbor is always complaining about my music. Formal setting, the CEO should avoid airing the company's dirty laundry during the shareholder meeting. Negative context, stop airing your dirty laundry on social media, it's embarrassing. To help you remember the meaning, think of a visual image of someone literally hanging out their dirty clothes for everyone to see. This vivid mental picture can remind you that airing dirty laundry in public means revealing private or embarrassing information. The idiom air dirty laundry in public was adopted into English from the French proverb il faut laver son ling sale en famille. And by the late 19th century, it became widely used in English-speaking countries. It likely originated from the idea that personal matters should be kept private and not exposed to the public. It is always used metaphorically to refer to the act of exposing personal or sensitive information. There are a few similar idioms you should know. Wash your dirty linen in public, same meaning, different wording. Don't air your dirty laundry, a warning to keep personal matters private. Dirty laundry can refer to any private or embarrassing information. Let's try rephrasing this idiom. Instead of she aired her dirty laundry in public during the meeting. You could say she revealed her personal problems in front of her colleagues. The meaning is the same, but using the idiom makes the expression more colorful and impactful. I once witnessed a colleague use the idiom air dirty laundry in public perfectly during a team building event. When a new employee started complaining about their previous job, my colleague gently interrupted and said, let's avoid airing any dirty laundry here. This is a time for us to focus on our team. It was a tactful way to redirect the conversation and maintain a positive atmosphere. One common mistake is using air instead of air out, for example. She aired out her dirty laundry in public. This doesn't quite capture the meaning. Another issue is misunderstanding the idiom's connotation. Airing dirty laundry is generally seen as negative, so it's important to use it appropriately. All right, let's test your understanding with a question. Which of these is a synonym for the idiom? A. Reveal personal info. B. Hang clothes outside. C. Clean up a mess. Great job! I hope this lesson has helped you better understand the meaning and usage of the idiom air dirty laundry in public. Remember, using idioms like this can make your English more natural and expressive. Now it's your turn, try using this idiom in a sentence and share it with me in the comments below. We were taught essentially not to air dirty laundry in public. You need to air your dirty laundry out in public. Air their dirty laundry in public.